I thought Tanya would have a lot more to talk about. That was a, that was a heck of a game. Um, uh, I mean, the brackets came out. I think everyone knows that. I mean, the seeds are the seeds. Um, we like our matchups, and I'd say that no matter where we landed. Um, but I, I think the seeding committee, for the most part, did a real good job. This is probably the best year that they've done. Um, there's kind of been some, there's been some issues, you know, in the in the past few years. But I think guys really got what they earned, um, and they've done a good job with that. So now it's just for us. We had work out this morning, and we head out tomorrow. Um, time to go compete. I don't know. I'm, I'm excited for our guys. Like I said taking seven guys down there that that are ready to to score a whole lot of points. Uh, other than that, man, I don't. I don't know. Whole, I don't have a whole lot to say. I mean, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready to get this this show on the road and get going. I think everyone is. You know, we're ready for Thursday morning and uh, for that whistle to blow, so our guys can can get out there and show all the work and preparation that they put in. Um, you know, we're really trying to make them make them not make it any bigger than it really is. You know, it's it's just like any other event, um, just like any other match. But I guess it's a little bit bigger because it's the NCAA tournament. But um, our guys are prepared and ready. So, I don't know, any questions? What are the different kind of goals that you have, both as a team and seeing out certain individuals? Uh, here's the thing with, with that is I don't want to put any limits. You know, I mean, I'm not going to put limits on my guys. Well, you know, we hope to have seven All-Americans. Well, well, how about national champions? Or I hope to have five All-Americans. Well, what about the two guys who am I leaving out here? You know, so I'm, I'm, I'm not going to do that. I know that our guys are prepared and ready. Um, they're going to go compete in a way that's going to give them opportunity to to be high on that stand, uh, and that you're going to be proud of, well, you know, being being a U and I, being a U and I Panther fan, and I mean, you're going to be proud of how these guys compete. Um, and, and we really talked about, and we've talked about all season, just kind of being able to go out and compete in a way that, when you're done, you feel good about it, you feel proud about it, you feel like you don't have a whole lot of regrets when you look back. Um, and that's how we want our guys to compete. We want them to go, let it go. And if they do that, then. We're going to be in real good shape. We're going to bring a lot of hardware home, and that's what those guys want to do. I mean, don't get me wrong; they, they, they want to, they want to serve some notice to the country right now. Uh, you know, there's not there's not a lot of talk about our team as far as being one of the better teams in the country, and I believe we are. I know we are. You know, now now it's now it's our opportunity to go show up this week. Um, so, so I'm not I'm not much for prognosticating as far as where we're going to end up. Um, I know that we're going to end up above our seeds, though. I can tell you that. How much of a motivator is that for you guys? The fact that you're not getting that recognition on a national level you think you deserve. Um, I mean, I use that. I like that a lot. I like being the underdog, <laughs> and then and then being able to kind of just laugh and smile at them after you prove them wrong. Um, I think it's a good thing. You know, a guy like Dylan Peters, he's a two-time All-American. He's unseated. I think for him, he kind of laughs at that. You know, and, and it's based on the season. He hasn't had a great season, but I tell you what, I Darren Cruz. I guarantee he is not enjoying that matchup. You know, like dang, I, I got I just drew a two-time All-American first round. I'm the four seed. Uh, you know, I, I. So, you know, for us, for him, I'm like, it's. It, you'll be the four seed. You know, I mean, make yourself the four seed, just like that. You know, you you go in one match and you are. Um, I think guys can use that as motivation. You know, being the underdog a little bit. You, you know, a guy like Luhan. He's 13 and he's a lot better than 13. You know, but now, now the thing is, is we can we can really uh, we can really blow those seeds up, though. And one of our young guys talked about it the other day because he just went to the D threes. He watched his brother, and he was like, you know, these big these one number one seeds going down. These guys are going down because you know you kind of see them tighten up, and you see these things happen. And it happens at every tournament. I think this is the twenty, I think it's twenty first straight national tournament I've been to, um, and it never goes to plan. It never goes to seed, you know. So, uh, you know, we want to be our guys to be the ones that are maybe upsetting those guys. I like the matchups and where we line up, and in now it's just time for our guys, guys to perform. But um, I think you use that as fuel, though. It's really easy to. I mean, it's got to be. It's really easy for Dylan Peters to. I'm unseated and two-time All-American. You don't think a whole lot of me. Well, I'll, I'll show you. So, how good is it to be in St. Louis and hopefully get a lot of purple in the house? St. Louis is a great, great venue. I, I like, I like it probably as as good as any. I mean, I, I loved it when I was at Des Moines. You know, I'm I'm a little biased because I like having it in the state of Iowa. Um, but St. Louis always does a great job. It's a it's a great spot. I think especially after having it in New York last year, I think a lot of people that didn't go, you know, I think are coming back. And 
I mean, hopefully there's a lot of purple there. I know, I know we, sold, we sold a good chunk of tickets. We got a lot of people coming, and you know, we had people calling, calling after the MAC tournament wanting to come, so that's good. You know, I haven't had that before, that people that, I guess I want to go to the national tournament now. I like how these guys compete. You know, I, I mean, I know Max Thompson. I, Hoshlog, I, I, I grew up watching that kid, you know, and now they want to go watch these guys in, in, on the big stage. So um, it's great, and, you know, we, we hope to impact the team race. You know, we're going to have big matches. Um, and if, if we're not one of the teams in the team race, we hope we're taking out teams that are in that team race, you know, and that's what, that's what we've competed and that's what we've trained for all year. So I don't know, I'm, I'm excited for our guys to get down there. Um, so anything else? What else can you say? I was 